What's going on, people? We are in Hollywood, California. It is 8 p.m. We're gonna check out Hollywood Boulevard. I have never been here at this time uh, in the last like five or six years. We're gonna meet up with Dan the Man and ride Surons. That's the plan. It's dark. So this is, uh, there's a lot of things that just don't really add up about what I'm doing right now, but we're gonna try and make a video and make the most of it and uh, have fun. And we're gonna ride the Surons. That's what's gonna happen. Here we go. Okay, let's do it. Let's get straight to the action. I wish I could turn this headlight off. That'd be really awesome. But it's not gonna happen today. First thing I see, getting out of the car, what do you guys see? A bunch of broken glass, and I mean a lot. When you guys see glass like this and this little, um, these tiny shards like that, that is from a busted window. It's not this car or that car. So uh, yeah, let's just, uh, let's hope for the best, right? And prepare for the worst. I don't even remember exactly where I parked. I haven't been riding in Hollywood in a long time by a long time i mean uh about a month and a half and that was the last time i was out here and that was to film uh that fire that went down that was a huge fire it was on the news and stuff look at that truck that thing's sick um it's not the last time i was out here i don't really come to hollywood for any reason and that's for good reason because it's uh you know pretty hectic out here kind of like downtown la on steroids as far as it's just, there's just so much going on. I'm a really simple type of person, right? When there's too much going on, I get overwhelmed quick. So I'm not a fan of like a lot of things happening at once. I kind of like it for it. Yeah, I like things a little bit more chill, so to speak. I think that's the best way I could put it. And uh, Hollywood Boulevard is kind of like the opposite of that. It's pretty much everything happening at the exact same time and uh, it's very overwhelming at that. So. You know, that's why I typically don't come out here. I mean, anyone who watches my channel knows that you don't ever really see me in Hollywood. Uh, at this place, it's not just a huge tourist trap. That it is. It is a huge tourist trap. But it's also like, it's just dangerous, bro. I'm going to keep it 100. It's, ironic as that sounds, Hollywood Boulevard is more dangerous than just about everywhere uh, that I can think of. As far as, you know, like metropolitan areas in L.A., there's obviously, you know, like there's some there's some dark neighborhoods out there, right? There's some bad neighborhoods where you don't want to go. But by and large, Hollywood is uh as far as a place where you would just think that everything's gonna be nice and sweet, it's not. <laughs> it's, it's really not. It's not that sweet out here, man. It's it's actually pretty sketch. Uh, but anyways, you know, we're gonna we're gonna play things by ear. We're, uh, he should be actually right around here We're gonna get to Hollywood and Highland, which is straight ahead And then we're gonna stop and give him a phone call if we don't immediately see him uh, So there's a few things going on with this situation right now. Dan the man is apparently with a little squad I don't know if any of them actually ended up rolling out to where we're at right now um, We're about to find out. There's a few things going on in the city right here tonight in this part of the city At least there's like a, a dirt bike ride out that I heard about I don't know if it's uh, if, it, if we're gonna run into it, if we're gonna see it. I saw some people on dirt bikes cruising to it as I was getting off the freeway and parking, but I really have no idea where they're going. Um, I don't really like going through this lane because you can get doored. Doored is when you're going down. This is like the quote-unquote bike lane. You know, as in typical in LA, there's no actual bike lane. I'm not saying that the turnaround should be in one, but it's not one in the first place. So, you know, thankfully that's a problem I don't have to worry about. But. <laughs> Even if there was one, people open their doors and they, uh, yeah, will uh, take you out completely if you're rolling down uh, the, uh, the bike lane. I call it the suicide lane because the bike lane is just, <laughs> yeah, it's, there's no, <laughs> yeah, good luck. Uh, it's just as dangerous as riding in the street. There's very little benefit to riding the quote unquote bike lane in LA because you get attacked from both sides. There's people open the doors, get into the cars, and there's people, there's so many Ubers in the city that they'll just stop and then people will jump out. And you, either way, you're, you're, you're screwed, right? You're gonna run into someone either way. So uh, your best bet is to just get through the traffic the best way you can and try to not crash, which is what I try to do pretty much every day. Anyways, hopefully you guys have been taking in the scenes as I've been riding and talking. There's uh, a lot going on in Hollywood tonight, as in every night, same, you know? Not a single night that goes by out here where there's not a ton of stuff going on. This guy's on a BMX bike. Kind of looks like one of my old ones, too. Hey, I know you. <laughs> it's Hicks. Oh, what's up, babe? What's going on, brother? How you doing? Just getting out of work. Yeah, okay. Are right, you be safe, brother. Yeah. 
he's a cool cat, man. He's a BMX rider. He's been he's been uh, he's been showing love since the early days. So shout out to him. He's doing what he's doing. Look at all these people out here. Holy crap! I just realized there's tons of people out here. Yeah, a little bit of sensory overload for me in uh, in Hollywood, but you know, we're out here. We're doing the dang thing. We're gonna chill for a little bit. So Hollywood and Highland is right in front of us. We're gonna stop uh, somewhere around where that car's parked, and then we're gonna give Dan the man a phone call kind of like low-key looking for him while I'm riding. I didn't see him the entire way up here, so I assume that uh, he might be right here waiting for me or he's just uh, somewhere else. I'll put the headlight down and we're going to cruise nice and slow on the Walk of Fame. There's the stars right there for anyone who's never seen them. But uh, this is Hollywood and Highland. We're going to stop right here and call Dan. We're actually gonna move up a little bit. I don't want to be packed in the corner. There's been so much crime going down on here that uh, kind of gotta watch your back in some senses. Hey Siri, call Dan the man. Okay, I'm gonna come there. I'm coming there right now. We gotta get around a little bit of a ways. Well, here's uh, Hollywood and Highland. This is the epicenter of Hollywood. Pretty much. A lot going on right here. We're just gonna slowly cruise through. Totally should not be riding through here, but you know, when have we ever followed the rules? Watch how I do this with swiftness. I think I was waiting me down. Oh. Look at the amount of tourists here. Isn't it crazy? I had to get off the sidewalk here. He's doing a live art. Hopefully, he's getting paid. Uh, yeah. So there's that. Okay, we're gonna spin the block and go to where Dan the Man's at. There's the Chinese theater, absolutely packed. I will be down to come and do a couple more videos here soon, but like I said, if you guys want to see more, let me know in the comments. We're spinning around, we're catching up with Dan the Man right now. I know a shortcut. We got to go up right through here, and there should be an alley. I think it's right here. Mm, yeah, no, it is right here. Let's swing around to Tacoma. And then cut through here. Oh, someone did a rush. No bueno. Okay, this is the parking lot that we usually meet up at for a ride out that we do. It's called 4130. So if we are talking about the same parking lot, there he is. Dan the man. <laughs> Dan the man's about to ditch me. Oh gosh. Okay, we're riding with Dan. If you guys didn't see the last video I did with Dan, he's a menace. <laughs> he doesn't stop for nothing. <laughs> he doesn't have a helmet. And he just goes. He knows all the dirt bike riders out here though, so. Oh yeah, they all know Dan. Oh yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, they know Dan. <laughs> okay, well this is a lit, a lit pull through. They're about to get active, but we're gonna chase them for a little bit. Downtown LA. Because that's usually where the dirt bike mobs go to, no matter where they're at. If I had to guess, that's where they're going. The Dan the Man, wild. All you hear is pushing motor. <laughs> we got the dirt bike. <laughs> Dan the Man rides dirt bikes, so he's been riding dirt bikes his whole life, so I'm just staying focused. I just don't want to crash. That's my main prerogative. So, you know, if we get ditched, we get ditched. It is what it is. We'll try to catch up as we can, but they're they moving, bro. <laughs> they're moving. Dan the man, he's kind of a different breed, so he ain't gonna get dropped. One of the riders is behind me. I can hear him. <laughs> I hear him humming. There they go. Catch them. Then we have this. I, this is, I mean, hey, I, I think 
think this is the ride that comes from Venice, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. <laughs> This is another e-bike ride. Maybe? I don't know. I see some e-bikes, so... Yeah, yeah. I see why you come to Hollywood so much. I... Dude, Danny's out of here, bro. I'm trying to get dead. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think it was on Highland. Just take a ride on Highland. All right. Okay, we're taking a ride on Highland. Dan the man is leading the way. Shredding down Hollywood Boulevard. I can't lie, it's actually pretty fun out here. I thought it was, <laughs> I thought it'd be crazy. I thought it would be like a uh, straight up Bizarro Fest, but it's actually, it's, it's, it's pretty cool. It's cool, it's cool. It's crazy out here. There's just so many cars and they're all like very impatient because there's so much traffic and they're all trying to get somewhere ASAP. Shred it on the curb, why not? Get the out of here. Keeping up with Dan is a, is a mission. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> yeah, that, that was fun. Yeah, yeah, that was a lot of fun. Hey, excuse me, you got any change? I don't, sorry, bro. Everything's got me on edge out here, though, still. I just, you know, just me being who I am. I'm always on situational awareness. I just always got to watch my back, always checking and seeing who's looking at me and what's going on and who's in a car and what they're looking at and if they're on their phone okay, so I'm showing so we got no hands <laughs> look at how packed this place is at night it's crazy it is what 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 what, what is going on there what does she want oh that's a that's a, a uh, street performer I was like what what the heck all right we're following down the man Talk about doing a loop through Melrose and then go south and doing some other stuff. I don't know. I know where my car is. I know how to get to it. We're gonna follow him for a bit, see what's going on. There's a bike parade right there that we just passed. They are absolutely turned up right there. That looks fun. Man, the man is just... <laughs> He's not living unless he's pinning his surround, man. Anything less, and he's just not having it. He's got to be going max speed. Late night Star Wars with Dan the Man. I don't have any glasses or nothing. My eyes are just bleeding. Check here, John. Let's cut up Sunset instead, yeah? Yeah, okay. Let's do that. Island, take a right, yeah? Yeah. All right. Heads up. And then that's gonna be that. And then we're on Santa Monica going southbound. Yo, Dan, I'm out. I'm gonna say bye to Dan real quick. I'm out. I'm hitting the road. All right, John. There he goes. Now I gotta get home. In one piece, hopefully. Look at that street light. That's kind of spooky, huh? Well, night video. All right, you guys are gonna have to stay with me all the way till I get back. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm just kidding. But we got a ways to go back. We have to get all the way back up to Hollywood Boulevard, which we just smashed from Dan was low-key just like going home <laughs> he lives that way and I was just chasing her there's no reason for me to go this way I mean I'm just out here chilling anyway so I just like riding with Dan because you know he, he rides fast and you know it's better than riding by myself sometimes so that was fun if you guys follow Dan the man on wheels I'll put his Instagram in the description as well we have got a little bit of a ways to go so I'm gonna do some sightseeing on the way back see what's going on this is this street okay I recently saw this street on uh on the internet there's this guy I always see on Twitter called film the police LA and he was filming this I guess they were trying to sweep this this camp out and uh they didn't want it to happen or something I don't really know what the story was but long story short hey we just rode past it and it's still there so you know there's that for you riding Hollywood Boulevard at night is what we're about to do. We're at Santa Monica, so we still have quite a ways to go. Yeah, a little police. What's up with that? What is that? Why is there a police siren or police lights in that random parking lot? If there's no cops, is that a new thing to do to keep homeless people from living there? If so, then uh, that's that. That's what we just saw. Anyways, I think we got a cat on a one wheel. Yep. Now oh, he's on an e skateboard. He did not even see me. <laughs> For the record, to say the least. Looking for curb cuts. After dark, 
not many. I think we're gonna curb it here. We're actually coming back up. Oh, bad idea. Coming back up to Hollywood Boulevard finally after a, a mission. Yep. Got the East Scoots. Hello? Do you know which way Highland is? No, I'm so familiar. I'm not so familiar in this area. I'm sorry. Oh man. Okay, thank you so much. No Got the Lambo truck pulling up. Bro saying rev it to a Lambo truck. That is probably a soccer mom in that mo. <laughs> Alright, we're back on Hollywood Boulevard. Let's go. So yeah, you know, as I said, I'll probably come here maybe once a month or something like that. I don't know. Once a week we'd be pushing it. There's not much going on here to like come here all the time, but I don't know. This could open up a new avenue of uh, places to explore for us. So you never know. I might actually come check it out again. I don't know yet. We're just getting our bearings out here in Hollywood. It's uh, it's a risky place. You know, not saying I don't already go to a lot of risky places, but this one is, uh, it's up there. It may not look like that because it's like, uh, you know, you see, all these tourists everywhere, but it's people lurking in the shadows that you need to watch out for. It's too early to really be like, uh, be like, oh man, well, what's going on here? You know, it's still just all the, uh, the regular people out and about as you can see. We just gotta get across the absolute mayhem right now. There's a few things to see out here on the sidewalks, you know. Let's pop up right here. Oh, bad idea. I look completely blocked. Go ahead and scoot down a little bit further. Oh, okay. Nothing's going on on the sidewalk. Let's just, let's just, let's just get home. We can always do a sidewalk surf any other day. So, oh, woo -hoo -hoo. bro was mobbing. To say the least, he straight up shin checked the cone. Oh, Bo's mad. Bo is mad. Okay, well, a little bit of Hollywood action, right? Okay, you know, got a little taste of things. Start making our way back to civilization slowly but surely. We gotta go back to the desert. These city slickers out here, you know, I don't. <laughs> now we have to curb cut right here on the Hall of Fame. to where I parked, which, by the way, I don't even remember where I parked. This one's for all the people who always complain, why are you riding your turn on your sidewalk? Look, we're at Hollywood Boulevard, literally the most packed sidewalk anywhere you can imagine, and I'm doing just fine, right? I'm going two miles an hour. Just because I'm on this bike doesn't mean that I'm immediately a rolling death trap, all right? So, I want you guys to chill out, just chill out. I am genuinely lost, so I have to consult my phone. I'll go up to Gower and make a left. All right, going to Gower. Dude, I think the coolest thing we saw by far was those dirt bikes, huh? That was sick. I mean, what a random thing to just pop into, too. I think they do that every weekend, though. They come out in their group and their little mob, and they do this ride from here to downtown, I want to say, and then maybe back. I mean, we are on a dirt bike. It's just like, you can do whatever. No, there's no range problems. And when you're in a big group, like the cops will see you. Maybe you'll get chased, but nine times out of 10, the police don't even care. Like they really do not care about seeing uh, a mob of dirt bikes out here. They just don't care. So you're pretty much chilling. I know the people might complain. I always see people making, you know, posts saying, oh, all these kids on dirt bikes are ruining society. I know it's pitch black, but that's the end of our first Hollywood ride in uh, forever. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure you get in the comments, let me know. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video very soon. Peace out.